Hello guys and welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to show you how you can connect two Bluetooth devices on one computer. Now in order for you to actually do that, you will need to have a software. So the link will be given to you in the description box below. So just simply go and click on that link. Then you will be redirected to this page which is virtual audio cable. Now over here, what you have to do is just simply scroll down and click on this download button over here which is download vss 4.67 lite because it's a free version and the one over here are paid so just simply click on the lite version or if you want to get the paid version you can get that as well just simply download it to a location now when the download is complete just simply go to that location and extract the file Now after that just simply open it and install the setup now over here just simply press yes then i accept now over here just simply click on this checkbox over here then hit install and now just simply wait for a few seconds until it get completed Now, if a new pop-up appears in front of you, just simply press yes again. Now, after this, just simply press OK over here. And then again hit OK. And the sound panel should appear in front of you. Now, for some reason, if it haven't shown or popped up on the screen, what you can do is just simply go to a control panel. Just simply search control panel. Then open your control panel now over there just simply go to hardware and sound then just simply click on sound over here and the panel will simply appear again now what you do is in this panel just simply scroll down in the playback section make the line one as a default and do the same as the and do the same for the recording as well just simply go there click on line one and make it as default just simply hit apply I mean okay then close this window then again close this window as well now after that just simply open the folder which contains the setup now in this folder you will find the x64 named folder just simply open it now in that you will find a exe called audio repeater.exe just simply drag and drop onto your screen now over here what you have to do is simply right click on your exe over here then click on run as administrator and open it administrator now just simply open it once again again as administrator now after that just simply click on wave in and click on the drop box and choose microsoft sound mapper over here and for the second one click on the wave injection drop box and choose line one virtual audio cable after that just simply go to the first panel and click on wave out and choose your bluetooth device then go to the second block and choose your another bluetooth device then just simply press start on both of them and that's it now you will be able to use both of the bluetooth devices at the same time listening the same thing so that's it and thank you for watching and do like and subscribe to my channel and take care